I'm gonna show you guys how to wrap your machine properly so you can be sterile. I know a lot of people are using these Bishop Power Wands. This is what we use. It's a great machine. It's a very versatile machine made by Bishop. They have a bunch of other types. They have a shader type and a liner type, but we like using the Packer. It gives us a little more opportunity to rely on our hand speed and our pressure and our voltage rather than letting the machine tell you when it's gonna bog back. It just allows me to pack black and get the grades that I want easier. But a lot of people are using these and I think that they're not wrapping them properly. The thing is guys, if you don't wrap it properly, ink can get in every crevice of this machine and I guarantee you, you are not properly wiping it down afterwards. So just to save you guys some time and make sure you're doing it in the professional way, you wanna make sure you wrap it really good. So what we're gonna do is, I'm gonna show you how I wrap my machine on a daily basis. First of all, you're gonna start with your gloves. Always start with the gloves. Don't do anything with your equipment or your client without gloves. I know a lot of people like to put stencils on without gloves. They like to do all that type of set up without gloves. I don't like doing that. It just doesn't make any sense. It defeats the purpose, right? All right, gloves on. So what we're gonna start with is I use the power wand. So it comes with the battery that, you know, Critical and Bishop had a uh, collaboration and they made this. So a lot of people were using the critical battery for the Bishop wand instead of the Bishop battery. So they did a collab where it just magnetizes right on. This is actually a magnet and it just boop right on there. And it works like butter. Let me tell you, this is my favorite machine. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to start with a bottle bag. You can use clear ones, doesn't really matter. You could use plastic wrap and stuff too, but this makes it a little easier and just a little cleaner when you end up wrapping it. So you're gonna put the battery on your machine and what you're gonna do is you're gonna slip the machine into the bottle bag. And what I like to do is I like to get this part onto a flat part instead of in the corner. I like to get it onto the flat part of the bag. And what we're gonna do is gonna make it really tight right there so it creates like a uh, a tight drum right there and then you're gonna poke it with something and then you're just gonna pull it back and now you got this tight snug fit all the way around your machine right here and now what you're going to do is you're gonna take your wand grip we use the wand grips from Bishop because they're a lot better than using gauze tape and all this other stuff and it fits perfect and the size of it is just great so we're gonna go ahead and open this up and this is what it looks like so really all this is, is gonna slip over what we just did with the bag and it's gonna screw on. And what that's gonna do is it's gonna hold the bag in place and it's gonna create a seal that is unbreakable here. There's no way there's any ink getting into here at all. So super safe. And what we're gonna do is neatly do the dope boy wrap as clean as you can. You know, sometimes it can get a little a little rougher or whatever, but as long as you make it all tight and you seal the bag, that's really what matters. So I like to give it a good twist just to make sure it's all sealed. And then what I like to do is I like to wrap it down at the base right here underneath the battery so I could still see the uh, voltage. Because you still want to be able to see the voltage speed in your button so that you could change your voltage or turn your machine off when you need to. Sometimes if you wrap this too messy over the screen and stuff, it's kind of hard to see what you're doing. Just make sure that everything you need is clear as day, okay? So once you wrap it around the base of it, you're going to want to take your paper tape or whatever kind of tape that you have. I'm using paper tape. It's just easy to use. And I'm just going to start it right here at the base. And you're just going to wrap her around like that. And now what you have is a perfectly sealed machine that is perfectly sterile with a disposable grip and it feels great. It feels natural, feels like I could do anything with it. And even if I needed to change my battery, all I gotta do is pull this little thing right here, break the tape and I could change my battery and then I just retape it. So it's not that big a deal when you're changing your battery. It's just very sterile, very professional. You don't want to skimp on this type of thing. I see a lot of people using these types of machines and they don't even wrap their machine, which is crazy to me. Don't be one of those guys. Wrap it, do it the right way, do it like me. <laughs> Shout out to Bishop, we love your machines. Bishop Packer is what we use. This is Shine, your favorite tattoo coach, and I'll see you in the next video.